Today I'm going to bring you the tale of Hero Brian and Steve. It is one filled with betrayal, anger, and injustice. I actually just made that all up, I have no idea what it's about. But anyway, here it is. This is a map created by this fella right here. I'll uh, link him down below. It, it, it appears that his name is Zick, so uh, there you go. Thank you for making this. And uh, yeah, we have to uh, start, but first we need to select a language. Let's choose English, and then we can go back to the start button. Okay, and before we begin, I better put some headphones on because I think there is some voice acting, so um, I don't want to miss out on that. All right, here we go. Hace mucho tiempo. <laughs> it's in Spanish. It sounds amazing in Spanish. <laughs> But, <laughs> what was the point of putting headphones on? Okay, so, there's the two gods. Steve had the power of creation, but in turn there was an opposite god. I'm totally not just reading the sub subtitles, I understand Spanish, by the way. Um, Herobrine could destroy everything he wanted. So Steve got scared and locked Herobrine in the nether. I mean, that's what any normal person would do. Everything went well, until the day when... Dun, 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 I will never find out. Okay. So, this is chapter one. Oh my goodness, we've got a full book going on here. Alright, let's, uh, let's go and check out this guy. Hello, Steve, okay? Anything in these chests? Fish. Today's my lucky day. Let's, um, let's grab this fish, okay? And we can grab the coal. And we can, we can get that cooking while we have a word with Steve. We've got some steak as well, I might just grab it. Sorry, I just leaves a raw salmon by himself. I'm very sorry. Hello, Steve. How are you doing, buddy? Wow, you actually paid attention to me. That's, uh, that's unusual. People usually ignore me. Let's see what's upstairs as well. Have we got anything up here? No, you have a, you have a nice house though, Steve. For for the the main character, you know what? This is very humble. Right, let's see what have we got. Uh, Hero Brian has disappeared, and we cannot go to get him because without Alex, he would fuse. I'm gonna start, I'm not sure about him. this. Is making much sense. Anyway, we need to go talk to Notch and bring Alex. I will give you the power of creation so you can go without me. Oh, the power of creation. Well, thank you very much, Steve. Right, um, take a few fish with me. We'll, we'll take four fish because you can't go wrong. I do need to eat one as well. Tell you what, I'm, I'm liking this journey already, all right? Steve, he's a good guy. He has fish. I'll be back for that fish later. Right, um, so the power of creation is mine. I don't know what it does. Uh, there's a gold block over there. What does it say anything about this? Can be placed on block of gold. Okay, it's coming together. So I place this, and a ladder appears. I like it. The power of creation. Okay, right, so we can go down here. I don't think I can get back through there now, actually. I guess my fish are gone forever. That is a sad moment, isn't it? Right, we have got, uh, we've got some signs over here. What does he say, okay? So Alex to the right and Notch to the left. Okay, there's a gold block of that. I know he said go to Notch first, but Alex is where we need to go. And there's a gold block. So I just want to see what happens when I place this on here. Will anything happen? You can't use it here. Okay, we need something something else. I guess the, that's why we're going to see Notch. We have a chest here. What's in the chest? Apples. I'll tell you what, I've got food for days. We're having a, a banquet today. Right, this is Notch's little uh, humble abode. All right, it's, it's a library. I'm telling you what. That's a lot of books, okay, and I see no sign of Notch. Oh, there's a little chest in here as well, what does it say? Alex. Okay, what what has this got to do with Alex? Let's have a look. On the first day of the universe, the Titan Notch made with three clay balls, two gods, Steve and Herobrine. Steve with the, the power of creation, and Herobrine with the power of destruction. Okay, I think we got that so far. And uh, when they were together, everything became unstable. So to avoid that, Alex, he created Alex with his last clay ball, the goddess of transformation. Okay, so that's, that's what Alex is, okay? There we go, it explains everything. Alex is the most powerful one out of them all. Okay, uh, gold blocks. You know, I'm not reading every single book, okay? Let's just uh, look at the title, see if any of them are interesting. Killing an illusionist. No, I can't be bothered to read that. Either. I probably need to uh, to read all these books, but you know what? I'm living on the edge. The two roses. You know what? That sounds important. What does it say? One day while well, here was... One was red, one was blue, one was red. Steve chose the blue one, and here by red and playing them. Who cares? Not me. Right. Can I please stop pressing my inventory? Right, is there any more books here of interest to me? I want to find Notch. Secret entrance. Now this is what I'm talking about. It says to find the secret entrance, you only have to launch between two bookshelves of the ground floor that are in the middle of the wall. Two bookshelves of the ground floor. On the ground floor, okay, I think that makes more sense. Right, um, that's, uh, that still doesn't make sense. We have to launch between two bookshelves. What on earth is it on about, okay? Launch between two bookshelves. Aha! Uh -huh. Wait! Aha! Uh -huh. So that's what it means. The secret bookshelves. Didn't fool me this time. Right, what's through here then? Ah, look at this. Now this looks a bit fancy, okay? Let's have a look up here. Anybody? Aha! Notch! <laughs> you weren't escaping me with that little trick. No, no, no. I'm smart enough to uh, to find that. Right, I'm gonna have a fish. Let's, um, let's talk this over, Notch. What have you got to tell me? Hello, SB77. Sorry, but I don't know where is Alex. Where Alex is. She is locked in the end since Herobrine disappeared, but the entrance is covered with bedrock, and to break it, you will need the power of destruction. Take this pickaxe and go to the dimension of Herobrine. 
Not j are you an idiot? Do you really think that's a good idea? Okay, we we're gonna go and go. Oh, my, uh, I can just <laughs> I can already see where this is gonna go wrong. Okay, we need to go to the uh, the dimension of Herobrine and steal the power of destruction. Okay, this this is not gonna end well. All right, I, I can already see it. All right, well if you ask me, this looks like the kind of place that Herobrine would be lurking. So let's see what is at the end of this uh, this tunnel. What does this break as well? This breaks Nether brick fence. Okay, I see Nether brick fence up ahead. All right, I, I don't think this is gonna end well, but we'll see what is uh, behind here. Alrighty, so inside here we have three portals. I uh, I should probably choose the right one then. Alright, we have one portal that leads to Entity 303, one that leads to Hero Brian, and one that leads to Green Steve. What is Green Steve? He gets everywhere nowadays. Okay, um, I mean, going to see Hero Brian is bad enough. I don't think I want to get Entity 303 or Green Steve involved. So let's choose the Hero Brian portal. Hopefully this um ends well, basically. Alright, <laughs> I'm kind of worried though. Alright. What is going to be around here? All right, we're in the nether. Okay, we are, um, we're here. Let's, uh, let's munch some fish to Oh, my goodness. Okay, this is, um, this is definitely looking like the kind of place that here, Brian B. What's in here? Eyes of Ender. Can we place an empire? Okay, let's, uh, let's take, you never know. All right, I've just got to make sure I do not fall. All right, one wrong move here, and, um, I could manage to die here, all right. <laughs> As if, so, uh, here, Brian, how are you doing, buddy? I just came to steal the, nah, yeah, yeah, not borrow it, just steal it from you. Not even going to ask nicely, I'm just going to steal it. Hope you don't mind. Um, somehow, I feel like something's going to go wrong when I uh, try to steal this power of destruction. But anyway, let's, uh, let's have a look. Man, this is some pathway, I don't know. Is the time to back down at all yet? Is the time to just go home, you know, talk about it over a cup of tea with Notch? Maybe there's another way. Oh, no, we've got to drop down here as well, okay. All right, well, let's be steady about it. Part of me wants to just jump down like an idiot, but we all know that that probably won't end well. All right, we've got to do it like a survivor. All right, so we're going to go steady. Okay. <gasps> he says as he falls off the next block. Right, let's uh, be careful. Whoa, wait, what? Ah, look at this. Floating as gracefully as graceful. Right, through here we go. Okay, <laughs> I could have floated all the way down. Um, okay, next stop, a maze. I hear a Brian maze. Okay, is this the right way? I think I just went in a big circle. I did, okay. Matt, this is annoying. Okay, we're just going to have to crouch along, guys, all right? This is going to be the slowest maze you're ever going to see, all right? Looks like there's potential around here, though. This is looking good. And I'm just kind of hoping for the best here. Okay, I think we've gone around another circle. No, wait, it's still moving. Let's go around this way. Yeah, this is definitely a circle. <laughs> man, this, what a maze, man. This is like the the, uh, the labyrinth you've never seen before. Okay, I'm taking a lot of damage here, but you know what? I'm, I'm going to uh, This is only going to be one of those mazes where I just suddenly end up back at the beginning. I'm like... How did I manage to end up back at the beginning? But, um, yeah, it's probably how it's going to end up. Yep, look. <laughs> what did I tell you? Okay, I think we're on the right track around here. We just took a wrong turn in. Aha, this way looks different. I see stairs at the end, okay? Oh, I was about to say it's a dead end, but it is not a dead end. Okay, I'm just going to have to eat some steak. I've used all the fish. All right. I am slightly worried. Why is there fancy music and everything? Was I meant to get off there? I have no idea. All right, we're going straight to the surface. Wait, is that... Oh my goodness, don't do that to me. I thought I was going to die of fall damage. All right. Where now? Okay. We are in the uh, the secret place, right? What have we got going here? Okay. Right, what happens when we press these buttons? Oh, it's a little... Uh... Look at that. <laughs> no puzzle gets the better of me, that's for sure. Oh my goodness. Oh, wait. What's this? The power of... I don't know. Should we just press the button and see what happens? I stole the power of destruction. It was that easy? Ah, <laughs> piece of cake here, O'Brien. Yeah, not a problem, all right? I, we were worried for nothing, all right? The power of destruction is mine. This is going to be just one of those moments where here, O'Brien just waiting at the end for me, and he's like, yeah, you thought you could steal my power of destruction, did you? Well, you were very much mistaken. Right, all right, Alex, I've come to save you now, all right? All's well that ends well. All right. Oh, wow, you live in a fancy little place, don't you? So this, is this going to take me to the end? Oh, no, I have the eyes of it. Somebody was prepared, you see? Look at that. I'm loving all the fancy sound effects here. We got anything off the end here? Nope. Yep. All right. Let's, let's just be a normal person and go through the pole. Okay. Hopefully there's no dragon or anything. Hopefully it's just a nice, straightforward end. We find Alex. Happy days. I've actually forgotten why we were trying to find Alex. That's not good, is it? But anyway, it doesn't matter. All right. Let's just get her. What is this here? It's a little uh, end gateway by the looks of things. So we're going to head through. All right. I, I think we took the right turn in. Okay. Oh my goodness, man. Look at the uh, the size of those things. I'll tell you what. There have uh, been some serious fertilizer. We've got a cool little pot. Say what? This is uh, this is interesting. I'll tell you what. Don't know where Alex is. I don't know why she's being kept here, but 
I'm happy to save her at this rate. Okay, so we can carry on going up round here. It's how tall is this thing? This could take some time, all right? It's gonna be going round in circles for about six million years. I feel like, um, yeah, I don't know what I feel like, but I feel like that we're gonna just run into trouble at some point. Oh, was that it? Hi, Alex. Um, I brought you an apple. I, I hear this. Where did that apple go? Wait, apparently, I can't throw you. If I could throw it to you, I would. Trust me. But look at it. It's just not working. All right. <laughs> Forget that. You're not allowed to eat, apparently. Right. We're going to go and press this button. All right. Hello, SP737. Was waiting for you. I knew you would come because I can see the future. Well, that spoils everything, doesn't it? Right. <laughs> as much as the past and the present. Time is always changing. The future will become present, which in turn will become... What is the point of this, Alex? Come on. Anyway, I can give you the power of transformation so that you can beat Hero Brian. Well, Hero Brian's not much. I stole the power of destruction like it was nothing. Don't you worry. Hero Brian recently visited me, and that's why the entrance was covered. He went to his castle. Use the power of transformation on the dark oak tree to follow. Okay. And and did you give me the power of transformation? There it is. The tra the power of transformation. Okay. So we need to go to the dark oak tree. Okay. He has a castle. Uh, there's me thinking he was in the nether all this time. All right. Some job Steve did keeping him in the nether. He just escaped like it was nothing. Salida. Exit. You see, look at this. We're learning Spanish on the job as well. Okay. Salida is exit. There you go. I want you to all remember that. Okay. You never know when you're in Spain and you're, uh, you're lost in a castle or something. Just look for the word Salida and you'll be able to get out. Right. This looks like the exit to me. All righty. We're back. Hello, Steve. How are you doing? And how are my fish doing? Look at that. Nicely cooked. Okay, we'll get the salmon on the job. You never know. I might come back. I might come back. All right, we're going to place this on this gold block. And it's created a piece of... That actually made me jump. Okay. Um. All right, we uh, we can go through here, I guess. Man, he's off to do this. Chapter two, the village. Okay, <laughs> which one? Creation power. Let's do it. Noobs. <laughs> yeah, I think I heard something about they created the noobs. These are the noobs created by Steve, which then became place. Oh no, you're Victor. Hello, Victor. What's up? I don't know how they how they got through, but the villager attacking us, and so we are only a few left in the world. The wall was supposed. These villagers. How dare they? Look at the noobs. You've created some amazing houses. Can I just say? All right. How are you doing? What's your name, sir? You're also just a random noob. You can't even speak. Okay. Well, there you go. We've got. Oh, villager. Whoa. 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 Simmer down. My goodness. These are the killer breed of villagers if I've ever seen one. Um. Yeah, I don't know what I'm supposed to do here, you know? I don't actually have anything to fight back with, I don't think. Um, can I just escape? <laughs> I don't think I can, all right? Do I have a sword at all? I must have something that can take these guys down. What about the power of destruction? Or creation or something? I don't know. I'm, uh, I'm in a little bit of trouble here. Okay, he's over there. He doesn't see me. And there's a way out here. I just found it, okay? Um, all right. Turns out it's not a way out. Please don't see me. I don't think he does. Okay. Wait, are you fighting? Will you stop killing people? All right, all right, I'll take it back. Do what you want. <laughs> Aha, I've spotted something here, actually. Oh, look at this. A little secret tunnel. Oh, a chest. What's in the chest? Ah-ha-ha. <laughs> and now we fight back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is this just a dead end or is there more to it? Uh, <laughs> okay, it looks like we're going to the actual... Th yeah, <laughs> from one thing to another, this is. Okay, oh, that's just around there. Yeah, I'm fighting back, though. That guy's terrorizing too many villagers, okay? Let's, um, let's deal with him first. I remember the days when you guys were nice. Well, that was easy. All right, villagers, it's time for you to stop terrorizing the noobs, okay? I've had just about enough of this. Yeah, that's right. You want to fight? Let's do it. All right. I better not slay a whole village. They might get a bit upset. Man, they're all right until they see me and then they just pull out a sword. Yeah, look at you. Go on, then. Let's go. Yeah, you don't stand a chance. There we go. Right, what's in this portal? Is, it, is there anything? Okay, looks like we need to light it, all right? Um, time to track down the flint and steel, I guess. He's got any blacksmiths around here I can just steal from. It's like, we're tired of you stealing our crops. This is it. We're finding back now. <laughs> you know, this over here looks like something in... Oh, my God. <gasps> whoa, whoa, whoa. Simmer down, man. Way to give me a uh, the fright of my life there. I didn't expect you to actually do something. I thought he didn't see me at first, but um, apparently Herobrine's fighting back, okay? I have the power of everything, though, so I'm sure we can do this, all right? Come on in here, Brian. My goodness, he's, he's tricky as here, Brian. Okay. No to okay a letter. What does this letter say? All right, it says, uh, "I'm here, Brian." But I guess you, I, but I guess you already knew that. I talked to Alex, and he told me, he told me Alex is a girl. <laughs> here, Brian doesn't know much. Talk, saying they're going to get me. Yeah, that's too right. You know what? Conveniently, we have some armor waiting for me here, so uh, might as well just slip it on, okay? And then uh, grab these powers of destruction. What? Anything else in here as well? No, just layers. Okay. Right. Let's um, let's go find here, Brian. Where did he run to now? Okay. Yeah, your villager mean villager minions are no uh, are no match for me. Okay, <laughs> I hope not. Anyway, um, there is a portal. Yeah, I don't know if that portal's of any importance. Is it opened up yet? Hello, guys. 
<laughs> They've all noticed me now. Ah, the blacksmith. The one place you always know you could nick something from the villagers. A stone axe. Okay, I don't know what that's going to be useful for, but... You know what? We'll, uh, we'll be able to do something with it, I've no doubt. At long last, I've found a clue. Symmetry. Don't know what that means, but... Potion of strength. Come on, I need something more of this. I need something that's actually going to help me <laughs> to uh, to actually get to the next bit. Well, I've had a good look around. I've pretty much taken out 90% of the village. I think that's the last remaining village. <laughs> He'll lead this village to great things. But um, yeah, I think I'm going to end the video here. If you'd like to see me do a part two on this, then uh, make sure to leave a like on this video and let me know in the comments. And of course, subscribe to be updated of when that next part does come out. So um, yeah, hopefully you enjoyed this. Very interesting story. We've still got to face off against Herobrine yet though. So uh, yeah. As I said, thank you very much for watching and hopefully I'll see you guys next time.